Hey everyone, welcome to Momugi's Food Fantasy video. I'm Rin, and today we are on the Food Fantasy Japan server where we have a new ranking event. And yeah, another one! The god, and you see who we see on the banner is in the middle Junmai Daijin Jo. Mm. Yeah, his skin. I think it's quite nice, his skin. Looks quite a little scary, creepy. Like, is that... Hmm? Yeah, it wouldn't be ours. <laughs> mm -hmm. We'll see, we'll see. And on his right, okay, our left is Inari, Inari Sushi. Yeah. And the right is Tsukimi Dango. Hmm. Oh, the yummy Japanese food for a festival. Yeah, let's go in. We have a very lovely backdrop. Mm. Mm, let's start from here. Mm. Yeah, a familiar format. This was similar to the oyster ranking event, eh? mm. and long thing as well. Yeah, long things ranking event was also um, this format. That is long thing T. Yeah. Mm. So, to summon uh, Inari Sushi, it's um, 980 points, or 988 of the items. Mm. And oh, we get an avatar, so they're like, hey, if you can't get the skin, at least you get the avatar. <laughs> that has a picture of the skin. I think that seems maybe achievable, right? <laughs> oh dear. Oh, oh! You saw the Chinese guide that if if our ranking event is the same as the China server, you need about two thousand crystals to hit this. Wow. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> I see. Oh, the reward for the Chinese server is Junmai himself. So this is when they introduced Junmai, Dai Jinjo. Oh, I see. Yeah, we've already gotten him in Gacha, so yeah, so he's not the main um, food soul here. Yeah, the food soul, not the main food soul reward here. So instead, we have sushi. Yeah, Inari sushi. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> Now it makes sense why Junmai is the one in the middle, eh? <laughs> yeah. So let's check out Inari Sushi. Hmm. Looking very fiery. Eh, wait, male or female? I assume it's female. Y you mean no? Eh, you assume it's male? Eh. Uh, it's Inari means fox, right? Is it? Or something related to it? Like a fox spirit. Ah. Mm. Yeah, she, she, yeah, she does look more female-like in this picture. Uh. <laughs> Unless a dedicated cross-dresser. <laughs> mm. Yeah, it's in the food itself. It's the one that has like a sweet. Pinkered skin with um, rice stuffed inside. That's the one. Yeah, I like that. Mm. It's like a nice mix of sweet and a bit salty to me. It's like because of the vinegar, right? So it's like, I mean, sushi rice is actually like, yeah. Mm. yeah, okay, yeah, sour, sourish. And then I'll put soy sauce so it becomes salty. So I think it's the addition of the soy sauce that makes it salty for me. <laughs> so, okay, yes, yeah, so I'll forget the salty part of the taste and yes, on, on its own, it's a bit sweet and a bit sourish. So, yeah, I like that. <laughs> no? <laughs> you don't add soy sauce? Okay. Mm. No, you know, it's sushi. <laughs> you do? Mm. Mm. So she does and still doesn't. And I do, so we win. <laughs> mm. 
Oh, so if if it's too sweet for you, you add wasabi, not soy sauce. Mm. Okay. If it's if it's not good enough, uh, then it's too sweet. Okay. Okay. Let's see the futsal herself. Oh, no voice. Wow. I thought that usually they'll release with voices for the Japan server. Hmm. Ah, Inugami is the preferred fallen angel. And let's see her skills. Hmm. Eh? <laughs> oh yeah! They didn't even translate the skills yet. Yeah, I mean, I'm, yeah. I'm like, huh? Are we on the Japan server? The description is still in Chinese? Hmm. Okay. Need to switch modes to read this. Hmm. Hmm. So it's a single target mm -hmm. and lower defense by 30% for 3 seconds. Mm, okay. And for the energy skill, there's no energy skill! <laughs> That's even better! <laughs> Great! <laughs> yeah, I'm. <laughs> I'm not even sure what I'm supposed to be <laughs> playing this for. <laughs> like, she's the main reward, right? <laughs> uh, okay. So... Oh, you check the Chinese guide? Okay, so from what you remember offhand, she buffs magic units. Mm, somewhere there. Yeah. Yeah. If we recall correctly. So, yeah. So, great. <laughs> Let's check out the animation. <laughs> mm. uh, she has a. <laughs> the US animation is more boring, eh? Maybe Dango will be more impressive. Oh, this one's quite nice. Mm hmm. Relatively doesn't have the bang that we are expecting from UR Fruit Souls. Yeah. Oh, that's all. Hmm. The five star portrait. Hmm. Yeah, I guess it's all right. <laughs> that's all. Let's go and see Zukiri Dango. So this is the usual gacha and here's where we can see Dango. Oh, we can't see his... Um, can we see his animation? No, we can't. Mm, yeah. So, hmm. Yeah, they usually let us click somewhere here to see his animation, right? And what skills he has. Oh yeah, the deputy vouchers. And they gotcha. Yeah, nice. Mm. Yeah, so... Well, we can't find it, so... Uh, going on. Moving on, yeah. Let's see... Yeah, so this is um, getting the... What flowers is this? Spring blossom? Cherry blossoms? Mm. Oh! <laughs> Yeah, mislabeled timings again. So, unless you are supposed to wake up between midnight to 5am to actually get one of those <laughs> sprig of flowers. <laughs> Not for people who sleep normal hours. <laughs> no, it's just mislabeled, right? Yeah. Yeah, otherwise you would... Unless you would see some of it lit up now. There's no option now and it's past midnight, so... Mm -hmm. Yeah, so next, this is the ranking rewards. And yeah, so that is Ina Inarizushi. And then the final skin is Junmai Daijinjo. Mm. Yeah, top 50. Yeah, I think top 50 is too much for us. Even we. I think we only hmm, 
Yeah, in the past we did it, but then yeah, uh, not recently. <laughs> Too many wheels on the Japan server recently. Mm. Yeah, we haven't fought yet. We're still trying out to see which is the best team. But some of the let's see, this is the top pay. Eh? The top damage currently. Yeah, wow, 20 mil in one battle. Uh, yeah, how many stars is the SP Rice? I'm curious. Ooh, four star. Wow. Yeah, <laughs> not five, huh? Okay. 240 mil. So, they, wow, they fought 12 times. Wow. Ooh. It's, yeah, we got zero so far. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, today's um, free tries only give us one and we are using that one to test for the best team first. Yeah. So, hmm. Hmm. Yeah. so the rest of it is Pretty much the same as the Oyster um, and Longsing T ranking events. You just slowly work up to um, getting the item drops, and there's a healing stage as well. Mm -hmm. And after you get the items, you go on to the next stage. Yeah, you need the, the red ribbon to get this screen. The, the screen. Mm. And with the screen, you get the boss. Mm. What's that thing? That looks like bubbles or something? Mm. Oh, Morning Dew. Okay. Mm, romantic. <laughs> the whole thing has a very calming and um, pretty feel like nature. Oh! Ah, you can't use power type. So... It's all magic, huh? Mm. Oh, okay, mad. Okay, not magic, but magic. Um, as well as uh, yeah, tank and uh, support healers. Yeah, only power or strength types aren't allowed. Okay. Oh, so today's bonus? Oh, every day's bonus. Uh, that's yeah, SP rise. Yeah. Yeah, the daily bonus for the whole 11 days, okay. SP rise and double scoop. And milk. And who's that in the, the second one? Oh, in the gacha, so we'll see her? Mm, haven't seen her before. Yeah. Mm. Oh, so... Because it's only 11 days, for the first 11 days, the bonus is that. But then, there's no bonus in the last couple of days. Hmm, I wonder why it's set like that. <laughs> to screw people over. <laughs> oh, yeah. I think, yeah, it's, it's very creepily pretty. Okay, he charms the whole party. And yeah, that sounds tough already on its own. <laughs> and ah, wow, he debuffs speed by yeah, attack speed by eighty yeah. percent. Oh, uh, skill damage goes up by hundred percent. For hours, our skill damage. Ah, okay. Oh wait, well, 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 okay, okay. So, so let's see. So, skill damage. Our skill damage goes up by hundred percent, but normal attack, normal damage goes down by ninety nine percent, and he also cuts attack speed by eighty percent. 
Well, this battle sounds. Well, you have to get like some, some good souls with very specific skills to get, yeah, to get um out of that attack speed debuff and those with skill damage, right? Hmm. Speed fallen angels, uh, useless here. Yeah? Hmm. It would still get the total amount up, right? Even though the the it goes down in percentage. Mm. Mm. Uh, for DPS, might prefer might prefer an attack fallen angel since the value of attack speed has gone down by so much. Yeah, this is um, this is very interesting. Yeah, unless we need to make use of the basic skill effect day eh? to counter his skills, etc. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, so let's try out a boss battle. We haven't settled our themes yet, but then we can just give it a try. So we are okay, we are using um this our team that we are trying with. Yeah. <laughs> Just shoot mm. mm. Ah, and yeah, for um, we brought a revive and the skill that gives energy points. Eh? Yeah. So yeah. Mm. Yep. Hmm. So we're using this talent, uh, cooking talent, since uh, skill damage matters more here. So it allows them to use their skills more often. So for SP rice and Battle D, they have the ability to fill up the bar more. So and rice is also one of the. Um, Break up food souls. That's another reason. Mm. That's another reason she's here. Yeah. Ah, yeah. Damage, double damage food souls. The bonus ones. Mm Oh, and fondant cake, yeah. Fondant cake is here because she has a skill that negates harm on the whole party. Oh, yeah, so that's why even though she is uh, only an SR, she's here. And... Mm. So she's hopefully, um, yeah. Has she, and we have a speed fallen angel on her. So that, um... Hopefully trigger her skill more since hers is that's her basic skill. Yep. Ah, mm -hmm. uh, yeah. So, but sometimes it doesn't trigger. So we may be charmed and die, and that's when we use revive. Mm. So, yeah. It's a long battle. It's six minutes, and we can't even auto this because we have to. Constantly use our uh, yeah cooking talents to give them more energy and revive them. Yeah. So for the rest, candy cane is just for the usual healing, our best healer and and buffing. And pizza is just here for damage. <laughs> okay, not just. He's a very good. He's very good at what he does. Yeah, we're still testing this theme though. So, mm. oh, and yeah, we're still testing this theme. And yeah, other things we're considering. There's also um, Cordyceps, right? It's another um, food soul that we heard is useful. We read is useful. Um, because he has a uh, ability. His one of his skills is to raise attack speed. So that will also help to. 
counter the debuff, the attack speed debuff, that 80% down <laughs> debuff from the boss. Yeah, so if you have a yeah, if you have a high star concept, that would be very useful. I was only one star though, so may not be that useful for us. Yeah. Then um yeah, we we will still try and see if his yeah if his um effect is good enough. Never know. Seventy two point three percent. Okay, so we are quitting on this year because we are still testing it out and seeing if we have any better teams. Hmm. Mm. Other than cordyceps, yeah, we're also thinking of trying oyster. Yeah, as a tank, so that um he can tank some of the damage from the charmed um food source in, in his team. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, when the whole party is charmed, they can all whack him. Ouch. Mm. Ah, so for people who use that the strategy of using a tank. They'll use the cooking talent, this one, this cooking talent that cleanses status. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. So that you can continue heating, he doesn't have to tank too long. And that's why you wouldn't need revive, eh? Because if Oyster is tanking the damage, then your other food souls shouldn't be dying. Mm. And this will actually um, give him back some of his um, health. So yeah, we'll try those later as well and see what our best damage can get us. Ah, so this is the gacha that uh yeah, we're looking we saw this foot soul in the um the damage uh, the bonus damage, right? Hmm, let's see. This is a uh, direct translation is Ah, Candid Solo's Nest. I see. Candid Bird's Nest. Okay. Yeah, Candid Bird's Nest. Okay. Mmm. Yeah, she looks very pretty. She does have a feel of... Um, I mean, because... Uh, Bing Tang, you know, is like... Like, literally, is like iced sugar. <laughs> like, right? Yeah. Like, rock sugar, rock sugar. So, yeah, rock sugar. So it has um she does have that kind of feel I think. Like an elegant dessert sort of feel. Mm. Mm, so yeah, Conch Queen is the preferred fallen angel. And let's see. Oh they translated this one. <laughs> yeah, not the reward. The gacha food so yes. <laughs> So let's see. She it's um damage on the nearest enemy, and other than that, there's also she also has an effect to stun, at which lasts for three seconds. Oh, but it's only for a single enemy, a yeah, single target stun, the nearest one. Uh, yeah, and she recovers ten energy for herself. For energy skill, she has oh, it's mm, damage all enemies, mm -hmm. as well as a chance of giving allies twenty energy, recover twenty energy for allies, and at the same time, there's a chance of buffing attack speed by fifty percent mm, for all allies. For five seconds. Oh. So yeah, this is also an effect that would counter Junmai Daijinjo's speed, eh? The um speed debuff, attack speed debuff. Hmm. So both her and yeah, Candid Bird's Nest and Cordyceps would be good for countering yeah the 
attack speed debuff. Mm. Is there any which is better? Oh, butter tea as well. Ah, butter tea for butter tea. One of the skills also has something to do with buffing speed, buffing attack speed. Mm. Either skill or artifact. Yeah, one of them anyway. Yeah, we Yeah, we don't really have um a lot of artifacts yet, eh? Compared to the China server. So the China server actually got that last month. Mm -hmm. They got this event at the end of February or March. Yeah. So it was, yeah, it's very recent and they have a lot of artifacts at the time. Hmm. But we don't, so we're just seeing the uh, mostly on the basic uh, en energy skills. Mm hmm. Mm. Ah, let's check out her animation. Oh, okay. Mm. Okay. You find this more impressive? Oh, this is pretty. I think this is pretty. Yeah. <laughs> you find you find this uh, prettier than in a research as well for a five star portrait. Uh, I think <laughs> well ten times that's too much. I think Nari Sushi isn't that bad. Ah, <laughs> uh, in terms of impressiveness, hmm, it's not. Uh, you're just saying that Inari Sushi isn't glam enough? <laughs> yeah. Well, okay, next. What else do we have here? Oh, these, the rest are just, um, yeah, those diary foot soles, eh? Or oh, the diary SRs. Yeah, Blue Cheese was a uh, ranking foot sole. Oh, and now he's in Gacha. Oh. Mm hmm. Yeah, this. This is uh this is the Ambers one that we is this the one that we had for Candy Cane? Yeah. Yeah, this format is pretty good. Yeah, as well as um Long Si Kyot Ham. This is the format as well. So it's like there's a guarantee on a certain step. Yeah. Mm, guaranteed shots. So it's pretty good, I think. Yeah, I like this one. Depends on whether you have enough embers to go for uh, high star foot so yeah <laughs> yeah for the guaranteed shots hmm hmm there's also this one hmm who's that SR one or another hem <laughs> why, why so many hems who in the who in the developer who, who in the developer team is like a fan of hems this is yeah Tinhua hem yeah. Mm. So yeah, that's an SR. Seen what I have. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Let's check out his animation. Mm. Ooh, not bad. <laughs> he moves more than a UR. Maybe you know you are also supposed to be like uh, every, even if the world is collapsing around them, they are all very calm because they're so powerful. <laughs> oh, you can't! Yeah, having trouble clicking on him <laughs> because he's moving too much. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, his five star portrait is uh, not bad. Yeah. Hmm. Ah, crossbow. Mm -hmm. Cool. I'm still very curious about Zukimi Dango. <laughs> Are we able to see him in the Foot Souls collections? As in the Foot Souls wiki or something? Okay. Mm -hmm. So for this one, it's the usual. As in, well, there's um, a three times rate up. For the U R, mm -hmm. for oh, for the first five times. Hmm. Ah, 
so there are guaranteed shots as well for hitting a certain number of poles. Mm. Okay. And how do you get this item? Mm. Okay, so limited to 40 times for embers. 150 embers per item. And yeah, crystals, 100 crystals per item is limited to 30 times. I think 70 pools allows you to get one of the guaranteed shot rewards. Eh? Mm. I think I saw. Yeah, you can get at least 30, the 30 shots with the. Well, relatively free because I mean, if you have enough embers and crystals. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, true seven Maltese Yeah, may not get her. Yeah. Then if you, if you only get the t-shirts without getting her, you're like ouch. <laughs> yeah. Then you, yeah, you can go play in this gacha to summon at least one copy of her. <laughs> Since this is well, the summoning part isn't guaranteed, right? But the shots are. Yeah. So. So this is yeah brute force tail you get her. <laughs> Yeah, we don't have that many embers left, eh? 60 plus. Yeah. So, mm. we. Yeah, we've used them for Candy Cane and Kyot Ham to get our 5 stars when it came out in this format. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm. Yeah, probably not enough for this, so we'll probably give it a pass. Mm. Okay, so. Yep, I think yeah, we'll probably pass on her. So I think that's all we have for this video. We'll go and work on our best teams. So yeah. If you enjoyed our video, like, comment and subscribe. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye!